Hey everyone, I'm Timaeus, and today we are going to do the Dwarf Canyon quest in which we will help our Dwarven troops uh, in the background there with their ongoing feud with the neighboring golems. Yeah, so these guys did not like these guys and what I guess invade them for some reason. Uh, hard to understand what a golem is, or uh, uh, hard to understand what a goblin wants. <laughs> Um, yeah, it's pretty much what I'm doing. So there's no requirements uh, for optional stuff. I recommend having some food um, during this quest. You may um, you can potentially die from repairing uh, one of these railings. As you see, uh, some of these railings are kind of bent, like that, like that one. That got, that one's kind of bent, needs to be fixed. Otherwise, I guess a goblin can kind of squeeze in there. Um, yeah, so yeah, so um, the recoil from trying to fix this could actually kill you. Uh, so if you're lower combat level, you may want some food. Um, also, you'll be entering the goblin cave later on, which uh, have some fairly aggressive goblins. Even at my level, um, I may still be kind of attacked at level 110. So yeah, just uh, just like a two summer fires is sufficient. And uh, and also I recommend a standard potion because uh, you have to run back and forth between this area and also the the cold trucks area. Uh, uh, I.E. the uh, Dwarven encampment here and also the, the, the Goblin Cave so this is quite a distance going back and forth um, yeah so make sure you have like one standard potion and a way to fast show to cold trucks oops is, uh, itself where we start the quest you can use um, uh, games necklace to prepare uh, assault and basically have your way self here you, uh, you need to uh, at least um, to do this twice um, so yeah, just keep that in mind. One to get here, and also the uh, one for for a, a later part in the quest. You had to like, go somewhere else, come back here. Uh, speaking of that, somewhere else, yet um, during the part of the quest, you have to go to the um, the Jorvan mines, kind of area. The Jorvan the Jorvan encampments on top of the ice mountain. So basically, um, uh, this this uh, this this mountain. You have to go here to get something uh, to bring back. Um, so I recommend I, I recommend using the combat bracelet to Ashville Monastery. Very close by, um, yeah. So that's why I recommend uh, you you only need this um, one X one time. That's all you need. So, all right, so start the quest. We're basically uh, make sure you have your stuff, um, your food, teleportation item, etc. And make your way to coal trucks. So you don't know where coal truck is. It is basically. South of Barbarian Assault, you can travel to Barbarian Assault using Game Sapless, like I did. And basically, just walk your way south. And then, then you can enter the gates here or here. So, yeah. I guess you can also um, travel to Ardunge uh, and basically head your way north as well. Or you can use, use the Skill Sapless to the Fishing Guild and head your way over here. So, uh, whatever order works for you, make sure you're, you're, you make your way to this area. And once you're at this area, it looks like this. There's a waterfall, the, the, the soaring falls, and there is the, uh, the other stuff, the fishing guild. <coughs> We're just going to enter this, uh, this area. You can also enter over there. There's, there's also gates over there as well. And we're going to talk to uh, Captain um, Logoff. Log Logoff. Logoff. Hello. Um, Guthix be praised. The cavalry has arrived. Hero, would you help us uh, by becoming a memory, uh, an honorary member of the Black Guard? The Black Guard, what is that? Ha ha, what's, what is that? What a sense of humor, we are the greatest thing that's ever existed in a German army. Excuse me, uh, only the best of the best are allowed to join. It's, uh, and then receive monthly, months of rigorous training. Hmm. However, we are currently in need of a hero, so for a limited time offer, I'm basically asking you, a human, to join us. What, what do you say? Uh, well, I guess if he's humble enough to let us help him, I guess we're humble enough to accept his offer. So let's do it. Uh, I'll be honored to join you. That's the spirit. Now, trooper, we have no time to waste. The goblins are attacking from the forest in the south. There are so many of them. And they're going to kill us all. Um, we need to fortify our parameters, our defenses. Please fix the fences and barricades. Okay, sounds easy enough. Uh, gives you six railings and uh, a hammer. Report back to me once you have finished the railings. Yes, sir, Captain. Um, doesn't matter what, what order you do this in. Um, just uh, 
uh, make your way to one one edge one edge of the fence and basically kind of just um, look for it. Um, try 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 to find something that looks kind of bent. So the fences that need to be fixed will, will basically will, 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 will visibly look kind of bent, like dent like this, kind of um, not straight. So just kind of uh, zoom in and hopefully you kind of find it. Um, there are six in total, hence the six railings. This, see, this one, this, this one is a kind, of, kind of like kind of um, off um, at, at an angle. It, it may, you, you may have to um, inspect it a couple of times for it can actually kind of be fixed. And uh, if, if if you fail fix, fixing this, you do get damaged like like one 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 or three HP, which can also kill you. So make sure you have uh, enough health. Um, just make sure you're aware of that. Oh, that that is one down. Uh, uh, you see that that uh, that is a recoil. Um, you you can die, you can die from that. So make sure you're aware of it. I think it also like reduces some of your stats too by like one or something. Um, we do see your, your crafting, I think, or um, something by, like, one. Uh, anyway, I, I think we're almost done. We just have, uh, one more, yeah. Uh, the location of these, I, I don't think, are randomized, so it's, it's pretty much, um, my location should be the same as yours, so it's just, um, if, if you don't know where, 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 where they are, just, um, just kind of just follow, follow what I did. It should be the same spots across the board. So once you're done with all those repairing, head back to Captain Logoff. Well done, Trooper. The goblins seem to have stopped getting in. Uh, I think you've done a great job. Great, I'll be getting on then. What? I'll jail you for desertion. 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 Besides, I have another commission for you. Just before the goblins overran us, um, we lost contact with our uh, watchtower, so I'd like you to basically check it out and see if we can reconvene, re establish communication lines. They should have been reporting right now, so just check it out. Um, Excellent. I have two men there. Just uh, see what they can. Just talk to them. Okay. So um, make sure you finish the dialogue. Otherwise, uh, the next, the next, the next part will, will, um, may not appear. So once you're finished talking to them, head outside this uh, gate. And just a wee bit south is this watchtower. This is their kind of a, um, I guess a watch watchtower. So hey, we all up to the top, and take this dwarf remains. Yep. Uh, make sure you finish dialogue. Otherwise, this uh, dwarf remain may not may not uh, appear once you get up here. So yeah. So once you have that, just head your way back to Captain Logoff because uh, we have no idea, no idea what to do with this. Um, don't don't just, don't do not, do not destroy it. Um, hello. Uh, have you been to the watchtower yet? Uh, I have some terrible news for you. The, the goblins overran your watchtower. Your guards fought well, but they were overwhelmed and killed, and one of them got killed. I can't believe it, Glob. Glob was the finest lieutenant I ever had. I'll give him a fitting funeral. But what uh, of his command, his son, Look, was with him? Do you find his body too? There was only one body. Um, the goblins must have taken him for prison. I guess, uh, please, traveler, find his son. Maybe uh, make sure he's safe. I'll find a hideout. Alright, so once you finish talking to him, head your way um, south. And the goblin hideout. The, the, the goblin hideout is just um, right by the uh, fishing gear right there. So just pretty much just uh, follow the kind of self curvature, um, so to speak. And once you're here, just um, crawl your way into his, his entrance. Um, there we are. All right. So now just pretty, pretty much um, just head away all the way to this in north um, west corner. And once you're at this corner, just search uh, this uh, this crate right here. This crate, and um... oh, ho hooray! Thank heavens you saved me. I thought I was gonna be gobbling lunch. <laughs> uh, well, um, you're not exactly exactly out the woods yet. Uh, the goblin's right right in your face. But anyway, are you okay? I think so, I better run off, mate. Um, okay, I'll catch up with you back in the headquarters. Thank you, brave adventurer. And he's just super tiny. And he just uh, vanishes into thin air. So now, um, make your way back to Captain uh, Logoff. Has Loco returned yet? Uh, he has, thank you. Without him, without you, 
he will be Goblin Barbecue one. Always a pleasure. In that case, could I ask you one, one more favor? Um, hmm. When the goblins attacked us, some of them managed to get inside and damage our canyon. See, it's kind of broken. I don't know anyone who could uh, make it work. Perhaps you could look at it and make something happen for us, please. Okay, I guess I'll see what I can do for you. Thank you, take this toolkit, you will need it. <laughs> so, so, why, so why don't you fix this, since you know what to do. Alright, so anyway, so use this cool toolkit on this um, broken canyon. And, oops, oh my bad. So let me just move over here. Okay, so, so uh, select the plier, it's the second tool. Use that to open the safety hinge, sa safety switch. Select the, um, the hook, and use that to uh, kind of move the spring out of the way. Select the, the the tooth item and then basically use it on a gear like that, and you have a working machinery right there. And then just uh, talk to him again once you're done with that. Hello again, and um, uh, it seems to work now. Take a look. Fantastic. I don't believe it, but it seems to be working perfectly. I can't see. I have seemed to underestimate you, trooper. Um, not bad, huh? No matter at all, your effort is appreciated, my friend. Now, if you figure out what uh, this thing uses for ammo. Um, hmm. The Black Guard forgot to send instructions. I have no idea with, um, how to use this stuff. I can't leave this post. Uh, you could, could you go to the Black Guard um, base and basically tell them how to actually fire this thing? Uh, okay, then. Um, just for you, my friend. Wink, wink. Uh, it's basically at the south of Ice Mountain. You need to speak to Nulodian, the Dwarf Canyon Engineer. Okay, I'll see what I can do for you. Uh, so like he said, we have to go to Ice Mountain. You can use... Uh, oops. Oh shoot. Um, you can use... You can use your um, combat bracelets to basically um, travel to the monastery, the, the Edgewood Monastery. Then basically you just head a bit, a bit uh, south, southwest and that's basically where it is right there. You know, I guess you can also use like a file to teleport or whatever have you, um, but this is basically where we have to be. So just um, keep that in mind. And once you're here, it looks like this. Um, there's Falador, the monastery, Ice Mountain. Head into this uh, west building. We're going to talk to Nelodian. Um, oops, uh, talk to him, not trade him. Hello there. Can I help you? Um, Captain Logoff sent me. He can't. He can't use his cannon. Of course, you forgot to send him the the, the way to make the ammo. The ammo mount? No, it does not fire. No, it does not fire a mound. The ammo is made from the mound, which is used to then fire. The instruction explains everything. Gives you a book and also the actual ammo mount. Thank you, adventurer. The 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 dwarf black guard will remember this. And there you go. Pretty pretty uh, straightforward. So the only thing I have to do is basically just deliver both items, the, the notes and also the ammo mount. Make sure you have both uh, to Captain Logoff. Hi. Oh, yeah. Well, any news from the Canyon Engineer? I have spoken to him and have everything you need to actually use this stuff. Um, bruh, you could just give me the Canyon as a reward. Yeah, you'd be lucky. Those things are worth a fortune. Uh, I'll tell you what, I'll give you a permission to buy one yourself from uh, the engineer Nilodian. He controls the production of them. He won't be able to give you one, but you can uh, buy it for the right price. Um, I'm sure I'm sure he'll sell you one. Interesting. I will take you up on that offer. You can complete the quest, got yourself one quest points, uh, some crafting SP, and the ability to use and buy a Dwarf Canyon. Uh, the Dwarf Canyon from uh, Mr. Nelodian in uh, the Ice Mountain. Uh, I think uh, the, the, um, there's a couple. Um, the canyon has, like, I think, five parts, and pretty much um, in total, um, the total cost of a, of a canyon is like 700 something GP or something. But uh, you, you only have to buy once, and after that, uh, if 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 you die with it or basically you lose it, it, it um, you, you have to pay like like like, like a a a, a um, a a a a, 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 grave, a graveyard fee to actually pull it back. I, I think it's like 20k or 100k, something like that. 
but uh, the actual buying of it is just it's just a one-time instance um, I, I think and it's, it's fairly useful has a, uh, a way to train uh, your range because uh, you can fire like um, you, you, you can put this uh, um, in like a in, in the in the wilderness for example um, just, just just drop it uh, right by the green dragons that's a, that's a, a one area can do it um, you may see also drop it the uh, uh, in here, in Faldor, you may see a, a kill guards, or may see uh, you can also do um, uh, the ogre city, Gruntar. Right here is, is also a very popular location to kind of uh, use it. It is kind of expensive, but uh, it, it is a pretty uh, efficient in way uh, in ways of training your, your your range. And that's about it for this. We have a solve. We have um, put this uh, beast back in action, and hopefully these uh, these mangy. Manji, uh, these uh, monstrous goblins do not harass uh, these um, dwarven um, troops anymore.